what's up, Hack? Uh, today I want to talk about trolls. Everyone knows them trolls. You know, people that just want to fucking say you're a douchebag and make you feel bad for some reason. but you're worried that you can't handle the hate? Easy. The best way to handle hate is to ignore it or to embrace it. What the fuck? Good job. Anyways, so you put up your first few videos and you find you got a troll or two. Kind of rare in the motor vlogging community to have trolls early on. Gathering trolls at around a thousand subs is you're gonna start getting hate trolls. Now, like I said, there's two ways to deal with it. You can completely ignore them, which is one of the best ways to deal with the troll. Don't feed them trolls and they'll starve and go away. Now, it's very, very easy to focus on a negative comment that is surrounded in good comments and feel bad about yourself. The main thing you gotta tell yourself is that it doesn't matter, okay? The key to putting yourself on the internet and staying positive is knowing that nothing anyone says can affect you unless you let it. You're born with a sword and you're born with a shield. Somebody says some negative shit towards you, you put up your shield, you block that shit. Like that shit never happened. It's pretty easy to do. Don't try to analyze why somebody hates you or why somebody's saying negative shit to you. There's no point in trying to figure out why they said it. They could have a legit reason, they could just hate you. That's not the point. The point is to recognize that this person doesn't like you. They're either trolling you or they genuinely hate you. Doesn't matter. So you can ignore them, which is, I would say, the best um, best thing to do. Probably ignore them. Or what I like to do is to embrace it. Nothing anyone says is going to upset me. Like, try it out. I don't care if you're my friend or not. You can leave me the worst hate comment you can think of down there, and I'll show you how to respond to them. We'll make it a little game. Now, embracing it is a whole nother beast because it's real easy to get caught up in a troll's bullshit. The main thing is to keep a third person look on the conversation that you're having with the troll. If you're going to engage them because they can be tricky little fuckers. They can weasel into your conversation and fucking make you upset. And once they upset you, they win. So, I think of it as like a little game or a little challenge. Let those fuckers be mad, it's fun as shit. And if you, like, okay, it's safer to ignore the troll, but it's so worth it to fucking kill a troll, you know what I mean? You slay that fucking bitch with some crafty ass words or you're showing if you show him that you don't give two fucks about what he's saying oh it's so satisfying all right let me run to the bank and i'll continue ranting to you bitches all right haters i'm back it was so nice in the bank and i come out here it's fucking hot as dick shits I know that didn't make any sense. Who gives a shit? If you're gonna interact and feed the trolls, you can't um, be upset if they beat you. <laughs> you know what I mean? If they say some shit you got no comeback to and you just stay silent, they're obviously gonna know they won. And you're gonna know you lost. So if you're willing to take that chance, fucking go for it. The internet can be whatever you want it to be. If you fucking want it to be a fun, playful place, that's what it could be. And a clever person will use the bad that surrounds the good and make the bad into more good. 
Does that make any fucking sense? But if I was gonna give some advice to new vloggers, don't give a shit about what trolls say and definitely do not let that affect if you're going to moto vlog or not. Or if, say you start moto vlogging and you do get some negative shit, or if it, in general, if anything you do on the internet, if you get some negativity, just fucking put up your shield, block that shit, doesn't affect anything you do. And do your very best to not focus on that negative comment. You get one negative comment and it starts to ruin your day, go back to your videos and start looking at all that good comments and all the friends you're making. You can have more good than bad, but you can't have good without bad. Make sure to thumbs down this button and leave a nasty, terrible, negative comment down below. You guys will see me in the next one. Have a good day, Pack. And fuck all the trolls. Not this one, but the next one. Oh, the door? Not this one, but that one. Fuck you talking about, girl. Shit, damn.